hello beautiful people welcome again to solishai's cuisine if this is your first time here thank you very much for stopping by and you are welcome to the family to this video i will be showing you how to make this crunchy puff puff without yeast So to the ingredients, you'll be needing some flour, some sugar, baking powder, salt, and nut milk. Nut milk is for flavor. You can as well skip it. And then milk and some warm water. The milk is also warm as well. So next, we are going to mix all the dry ingredients in a bowl after mixing all the dry ingredients i added the milk and also the water so for this recipe i actually use a cup of milk and i measure one and a half cup of water but i did not put all the water at once so i actually was putting the water bit by bit until i got the consistency of the butter i wanted if you don't have milk at home feel free to use just water for this recipe again the water and the and the milk should be warm and if you're using just water the water should be warm be sure to find the ingredients in my description box below So guys, after mix mixing properly, this is just how your texture or your consistency of your batter should be. You should be able to scoop it when you want to fry. So exactly like this. That's the reason why you shouldn't put the water all at once. For this pop-off, you don't need to keep it to rice because it doesn't have yeast. The next thing we want to do is to start frying so i already had my oil on the fire it's hot and i'm just going to scoop my pop off as you can see and fry until golden brown on medium heat So guys, the puff puff is really crunchy on the outside and soft on the inside. This can be done in 20 minutes and I tell you, your kids will love it. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, share and leave a comment below if you tried the recipe. And also don't forget to subscribe and click on the notification bell. Until I see you in the next one, stay safe, keep loving one another. Bye-bye.